Hello everyone, and welcome to the first development video blog for Caribbean, an early access title on Steam. Caribbean is a sandbox pirate RPG based on the engine of Mountain Blade Warband. The game takes a larger focus on battles, both on land and sea, and management of your character, ships and crew. The game is currently in alpha, and its basic features are already implemented. Content-wise, it's 70% complete. So what we're mostly planning to do during the early access stage is to build upon and improve what we already have with regular updates and your feedback. Of course, naval battles and boarding fights are already in the game. Ships are pretty easy to control, but they are affected by wind direction. There are several types of damage that ships can deal and take during the fight, to the point where they can lose sails and even catch fire. When your ship approaches an enemy one, you can choose to board it and try to capture it with the brute force of your own crew. You can also purchase unique upgrades for your ships, like a more solid hull, fire protection, damage reduction for the crew, a greater chance to ignite an enemy ship, and more. The ship's artillery and your crew can be improved as well. There's also a set of special perks available for your character that lets him perfect certain areas of his pirate life. Some of the upcoming features are nearly complete, but still need some fixing and testing. Like battle planning with squad management, for example, which will let players change the formation of their armies before a fight even starts. The same goes for the new production and trading system, something we're confident will introduce more varied gameplay. The boarding system isn't final at this stage, and working on it is one of the main development goals for the near future. It's planned to be largely improved and updated with new ships to provide more challenging fights and more scope for different tactics. We're also planning to add artillery for sieges on cities and fortresses. To provide more meaning to the end game and something for the player to work for, we're planning to introduce meta goals for each faction later in development. If the player completes them, the game can be considered finished in a way. Some examples of these might be the foundation of a Franco-American alliance, or repulsing an English punitive expedition against pirates. Don't forget to visit the official forums and Steam discussions for information about future updates. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.